Wednesday morning, uh, 6 a.m. We're about to go train some legs. Very tired this morning. I was up pretty late last night editing a video. Um, I didn't train yesterday morning, so I thought, I'll do it after work. There's a 24 hour gym, uh, man, till about 8.30. So I turned up about 8 o'clock. It was all locked up. I take a pre workout, 8 o'clock, nowhere to train. And uh, we all know how that turns out. So yeah, sleep wasn't the best last night. So a uh, little bit groggy this morning. Um, taking more pre-workout, uh, trying to get me motivated. So uh, we're gonna go smash this leg workout, um, get, get on with the day. Uh, finish it a little bit early today. And we're gonna go see a band play in Melbourne. Uh, it's gonna be awesome. Um, yeah, we're, go we're gonna take you guys along uh, with us and uh, we're gonna have some fun. We have a confession. <laughs> We're on a date night. Date night, bitches. Date night. It's date night. But this is no ordinary date night. We're meant to be in Melbourne watching a band play. But we missed the band play. They were actually last week, not this week. So we decided to go on a date, go for some dinner, watch a movie, and that should take our minds off it. If not, we're just gonna cry. Go find a corner and cry. Look at my hair. It's terrible. Hey Steph. So, we're gonna go check out Groove Train. Only got here a couple weeks ago. Hopefully they do some good food. I'm excited. Oh, smells good. That's a good start. Yeah. Uh, so here we have some steak, porterhouse, some uh, white potatoes and some sort of pepper sauce. No idea what that is. Steph got carbonara, gnocchi, plenty of cheese. That's awesome. And a Diet Coke. It's meant to be a Coke Zero, but they messed it up. So that's just a little example of how you can still eat uh, within your means and still go out midweek. Um, you know, with stuff like steak, most menus have steak, chicken, um, you know, white potatoes. It's pretty macro friendly. Uh, if you're on a diet, there's always a salad or something like that. Diet Coke is a savior. Uh, if you don't like caffeine, well, you can drink water. Um, works in great for me. Um, had room for some fats, and I left enough room for some popcorn at the movies. One bucket of large popcorn, all to myself. 24 grams of fat, 51 carbs, eight protein. I didn't even know there was protein in popcorn, but I do now, so it makes me love it even more. It's all about the gains. Um, yeah, so that's gonna finish my day off nicely. I probably won't eat a whole large one to myself. We usually share one. See? 
That's it. So we went to the new group train for the first time. They messed up the drink order. They messed up the food order. And I think the guy was being super nice to us because we had a camera. I think we were like food bloggers <laughs> or something. <laughs> uh, he was being way too nice. So I think we're going to take it more places. We might get special treatment everywhere we go. <sighs> Don't go blogging anymore. Yes, Why? Because you won't be allowed to. We'll be kicked out. We might get kicked out for vlogging in here, but who cares? We're crazy. We're just hanging out in Kmart while we're waiting for the movie. Everybody loves a Kmart run. You can buy things like this. Wonderful, wonderful women's singlets for seven dollars. <laughs> Or these lipsticks for four dollars. <laughs> Here he is, the man himself. The reason we all do this damn fitness thing. Who am I kidding? It's this guy. He's got a killer core. All right, so it's Friday morning. Um, physique update. A little bit heavier this week. 152.2, which still isn't really that bad. Um, still looking good, still feeling good. Uh, yeah, second week into this reverse diet, things are slowly coming back to normal.
just finished a workout and had a massage so a little bit uh, chilled right now just want to recap over the week training's been going well um, diet's going well I decided to up my calories even more this week um, I was going for a reverse diet approach um, it's turned into more of a uh, recovery diet approach more like the uh, Alberto Nunes style so my carbs are quite high a um, little bit of fat gain this week but that's okay it's only for a few weeks and then we'll, we'll readjust but feeling way better for doing that um, yeah strength's going up workout to workout which is great uh, loving the uh, loving the intensity so that's good um, I've joined a new gym as well, a 24-hour gym. I'll show you guys that in uh, in the next video. Um, yeah, it's cool. It's gonna it's gonna free me up a lot uh, a lot more time to uh, to vlog and uh, edit and uh, do lots of other things, read and and educate myself on other other things. Um, yeah, so this weekend just been working out. Basically, had a really relaxed weekend. Uh, obviously went to the uh, the muscle festival yesterday, which is just a whole load of food. Uh, pretty been pretty chilled on my macros this weekend. Uh, just been eating freely, really, and uh, body stayed pretty good. I think it's the uh, consistency in training and cardio that sort of got me across the line. Just been intuitively eating, really. Um, and yeah, I think it would, with barbering, um, we've got some dates for a uh, for a competition uh, at the end of March, so that's great. So I'm going to show you guys the sort of the journey of that, prepping for that, finding models, picking stars, training for it, and um, we'll, we'll go along, take the camera along as well, and uh, blog the whole thing. So yeah, just a recap. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, like and subscribe, and leave a little comment if you want to and uh yeah we'll, we'll catch you in the next one